Here at the Robot World Cup in India, this robot is gearing up to lift weights, run a marathon and a short race. Here it sprints its way to first place in 1 minute 37 seconds. But creating the robot took a lot longer than that. Each year, a few weeks after the competition, the robot is taken apart uh, and completely gets redesigned. We've gone for a, a year of um, making our system robust this year. Peter Gibbons and his team had to design a robot that was strong as well as a good runner. The versatility that this requires was a big challenge. We have to have a hand that is capable of um, for weightlifting, it's got to hold a bar. Uh, at the same time, it needs to be capable of potentially trying to climb a wall as well as trying to hold a ping pong ball because that's part of the basketball event. The team decided on lightweight hands to help with balance. Like a human, it has strong legs. The team also tried to model the way we walk. What we've been able to do is try and look at the human system and try and look at how we sort of catch our fall, that we naturally sort of fall forwards. And we're trying to get in implement that onto the robot so that it, it, it dynamically falls rather than having an exact control of every position it's at. This approach allows the robot to move faster, but the team also had to perfect its brain. It has to be able to recognize its surroundings and orient itself. The robots um, are fully autonomous uh, and we, so we have to set a program together so that it takes a picture we then have a look at the picture and trying to find either through looking at edges, uh, looking for a circle such as a tennis ball, and then what we'll have to do is use the program to say, right, okay, we need to move forward or we need to move sideways, uh, and then we have to try and orientate ourselves either towards the goal or to follow a line. The robot's brain performed well, but a leg motor broke during a race. Overall, it came in sixth place out of 13 competitors. Now the team will be making improvements so that next year it can walk up slopes and have better balance.